Hi there, Marla Neufeld here, your Florida surrogacy attorney. As you can see from our classic palm trees, I am based in South Florida, and I am a reproductive attorney and former intended parent. So I do receive many questions about why would somebody need to perform a step-parent adoption? So a step-parent adoption is a legal proceeding that can be completed by a married couple in order to have the court confirm the parental rights of the parent who did not give birth to the child. So in Florida, and actually across the country as of 2010, same-sex marriage was legalized. So in Florida, any child born into a marriage is presumed to be the legal child of both parents. So when a child is born to a couple, and in, in this instance, I'm referring to a same-sex couple, uh, the child will be deemed, presumed to be the legal child of both parents. Both parents should be placed on the birth certificate when a child is born in Florida to a same-sex married couple. That being said, it is still recommended as the legal best practice for a same-sex married couple who has a child uh, this is not through surrogacy. Just is one of the partner, one of the parties is the one who um, delivers the child, regardless of whose egg and sperm was utilized. So, it's still recommended that the parties perform after the baby's born a step parent adoption. The reason for that is a birth certificate is a presumption of parentage. It can be overcome. So, the strongest legal protection that you can have is an actual court order confirming that both parents are the legal parents of the child, that the child will inherit from both uh, parents, and that the, both parents have full legal responsibility for the child. Um, and this court order, as I said, is can only be entered after the child is born. So what, the importance of having a court order is that it's recognized in all 50 states through the full faith and credit law so no matter what happens, if same-sex marriage changes or the parents move within the United States or even more importantly, move internationally, it's always very important to have that court order in place confirming the legal rights of both parents, which is, as I said, a stronger protection than the birth certificate, even though it may list both parents. So it really is a belts and suspenders action to take. It's fairly simplified. And it's still very much recommended that a same-sex couple that has a child when they're married to perform the step-parent adoption after the baby's born. The legal proceeding for an unmarried couple to take, for the same-sex unmarried couple to take, is called a second-parent adoption. It's a little more involved than a step-parent adoption, but the end result with that court order is that very strong protection uh, confirming the legal rights of both parents. If you have any questions regarding a step-parent or second-parent adoption, please feel free to reach out to me at 954-761-2929. Thank you very much.